stand on them, they need to use them, and then when it comes time to them defending them, they need to defend them. Merry Christmas, my Christmas card. Thank you. Late. Late. <laughs> Thank you. So what would happen if the BLM tried to uh, bring a, a new court order and do another comment? What would happen? I don't know, you'd have to ask my dad. <laughs> Good but I'm sure he's going to do whatever it takes. Revolution. I've heard it. What's Thank he going to do? Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. <laughs> we'll do that. I don't know exactly what you how. say to David or not, what would be your message to them right now? They're going to be okay. They, uh, this, this court can't continue with a trial against them. The same advantage that uh, the judge mentioned that the prosecution would have against us in trying to us again will apply to them too because the government will have that same advantage over them. There's no way that that trial can go forward. So you said um, on April 12, 2014, you stood up on the lamppost and you said the West has now been won. Um, what do you say to that today? Well, maybe I spoke too soon because the West certainly has not been won and I don't think that it truly is yet now. But the state of Nevada and her people and the, the government which they have employed needs to, to make that stand and say, yes, the West has been won. We do own this land, the state, people of the state of Nevada, and we will now start to live like that and defend it. Thank you. About my Congratulations. Team.